David Ennis, the Treaty Compliance Officer for Spangdalem Air Base, the Benelux, in Northern Europe, has an extremely important job and few on base know of it. He is the sole person responsible for helping 52nd Fighter Wing and local sister service leadership remain in compliance with critical international treaties across Europe with the partner nations of NATO. Mr. Ennis, with the help of the Defense Threat Reduction Agency, aids international inspectors with evaluating the base's compliance with a critical treaty the President of the United States signs with NATO's leaders in order to maintain peace and stability across Europe. The treaty is called Conventional Armed Forces in Europe, also known as CFE. What it does is it limits the number of equipment, such as combat aircraft, and numerical limits on personnel within the European region. This is the longest period of time Europe has gone without a war. In order to remain in compliance, inspectors can give as little as three days notice for an inspection of Spangdalem's treaty limited equipment. While escorted by Mr. Ennis and Dieter personnel, these inspectors can enter any building on base with doors wider than two meters across to see if any TLE is present. Now, if you were to be selected as a local escort or you just came across them through the course of the day, be very polite. If they were to ask you more technical questions, refer them to the DITRA representative that is with them, please. According to Mr. Ennis, the most important thing to remember about these international treaties and inspections are, they're levels above the wing here. We don't realize the real importance of these treaties and how they keep Europe safe and secure. Reporting from Spengdalm Air Base, Germany, I'm Staff Sergeant Matthew Bright.